my channel. Now today we're gonna be making the ever so famous Dulce de Leche candy. And this is not necessarily quick to put together, but it's so easy. It just takes two ingredients. Just one bite of this candy and it'll literally be melting in your mouth. It's so delicious. Now let's get started. To start this dulce de leche, I'm simply adding two pounds of sugar to my heavy pot with one liter of milk. Now when you're making this candy, since it's only two ingredients, try to get a hold of the best possible products you could get your hands on. Use an organic, full fat, whole milk for the best flavor and a cane sugar for that extra rich flavor of sweetness. Mix all of this into your heavy bottom pot on a medium low heat and you're gonna leave this to simmer for two hours. You heard me right. This is gonna cook in the pot until it's super concentrated. You don't necessarily need to be watching it the whole time, but be sure to stir it every now and then so that it won't burn on the bottom. Keep this at a medium low heat so it's lightly simmering and you'll notice it reducing every few minutes. If you guys are new to my channel, I post new recipes every other day, so be sure to subscribe if you haven't already so you won't miss out. Now after about an hour, you will notice the milk has changed in color into this light golden brown caramel, and this will mean that it's almost ready. Continue to stir this, being sure that it's not sticking to the bottom, and this, as you can see, is the most beautifully delicious dulce de leche topping for ice cream if you wanted to reserve some on the side. But we're not quite there yet, so keep stirring this and this is gonna cook down. So once you have this very deep golden color and the sides are slightly crusting, this will finally be the time to remove it from the heat. Your dulce de leche is finally ready. This is extremely lava hot, so work very carefully here. You could either pour this into candy molds, or like I like to do, I roll this onto a log on parchment paper and cut it into slices. This dulce de leche firms up rather quickly as it cools, so whatever shape you decide to make, do so before it cools down. And that is pretty much it, you guys. I told you, this is a very easy recipe, but it takes a little bit of time. But it is so worth it because the taste of these dulces are so milky and rich in flavor. They're like nothing you've ever tried before. I wanna thank you so much for tuning into my channel. And if you guys enjoyed this recipe, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and stay tuned for more of my future recipes. I'll see you next time.